were a couple citizens who came across it in the River Valley. They were actually out for a hike uh, pretty near Capilano Park. Uh, Dr. Allison Murray, she's the professor who I work with, um, who studies fish here at the University of Alberta, quickly recognized, yeah, this is a sturgeon we're looking at. This uh, piece of rock actually comes from the underside of the head of the sturgeon. And these are um, pretty soon after that we realized, hey, this is likely a new species. So we're talking about the late Cretaceous and actually specifically um, it's about 70 million years old, so it's the late Companion uh, is when this particular sturgeon came from. They're really cool fish because they've got this extremely long evolutionary history. They're going back all the way to the dinosaur times and they looked very similar in a lot of ways back then. So it really quite a remarkable body form that's remained pretty unchanged. There's just a lot of interesting questions to ask about, hey, why is that so evolutionarily successful? It's kind of been a, a lifelong interest of mine. I always loved fish. I would beg my parents to take me to, to any aquarium. Growing up in Alberta, we're, we're blessed to have the Royal Terrell Museum of Paleontology. I spent a lot of time in those galleries, really knew them front to back. I could probably be giving tours when I was 10 years old. So it's, it's been cool to meet, you know, essentially meet your heroes uh, and work with some, some people who are pretty important in the field.